Greetings and salutations, folks, and welcome back to Mortal Kombat 11, where, um, I've come to a realization that, um, I haven't blocked, uh, in this entire game. Um, and I, and I feel the reason why is because it is that separate button. Um, like in Street Fighter, you block just by holding down ba backward. Uh, in, in Mortal Kombat, it's always been a separate button. And I, I guess I f feel as though I, like, I forget about the act of blocking simply because it feels like a... Um, it has to be a manual response. With uh, Street Fighter, just the act of moving away also blocks. So it, it so blocking is automatic. It's almost passive in a way. Uh, whereas the act of blocking in this game means you're stopping the offense to take a defense. Um, more so than just backing away from your opponent. Um, so I'm in this set of chapters, I'm going to attempt blocking, see how well that goes. In the meantime, let's skip to the beginning of uh, Jax and Jackie. Alright. Now we're on a boat of some sort. I believe this is the last chapter that offers me a choice between characters. Uh, so I'm going to try to switch between Jax and Jackie. Um, but like the situation with uh, no sign yet with the Kung Lao and Liu Kang, I'll, if I start to do poorly with one character, I'll probably lean on the other. Luckily it seems as though I don't have to worry about playing as Kung Lao again. Nor in my future. I feel like I finally come up for air. Those bad things that happen to me, I mean, will happen to me. Like Raiden said, it's gonna be different. Isn't this good news? I would imagine so. The things that happened to my dad, that trauma he suffered, it's why my parents met. They fell in love while he was in recovery. If they don't happen, you and mom may not meet. Basically, all they really needed to tell their past selves, assuming their past selves get returned to the timeline, is you see Sindel, just just blow her up. She is pretty much a cause for a lot of the bad stuff that's been happening. Considering the fact that she like killed half the cast in uh, Mortal Kombat 9. Also, the green gas layer is quite thick on that island. Or is that the residual energy of the souls? Um, also, am I expecting to find Jack, older Jacks here? Uh, attempting to protect this place because he's like, I need to start a family. I need to protect the legacy. That's exactly what Jack sounds like, by the way. Um, but yeah, is he going to be protecting this place and will Jax or Jackie have to fight him? I would imagine so. Also, is this the island from uh, Mortal Kombat 9? And is that boat going to crash into that gate? Shang Tsung's island. Here we go again. Nope, that boat was uh, was perfectly formed to uh, to go to pass underneath. You know, it's not a good thing if there are still bodies hanging from the rafters. Like, how long have they been there? Also, it seems that most of the ninja clans in this game, unless they've allied themselves with some sort of hero character, uh, they're usually, um, 
just one step away from being horribly murdered. When I was here for the tournament, there were people everywhere. Okay, so this actually occurs after Mortal Kombat 1. Yesterday. I'm I, sorry, should I say, uh, this version of Jax was plucked out of time after the first tournament. Before the second tournament? Because at that point, Cabal doesn't know that he dies, so... Multiple contacts. How many? Two, but one of them circling us real fast. Is that Cabal? Yeah. And this would be young or old. Judging by the arms, this would be Revenant Cabal. Let's play as Jax. Give me ten seconds with this guy. Jax Braves. We were partners under Quan Chi's command. You'll join but wouldn't you need uh, Quan Chi to bring tracks. me back as a revenant? I, I don't think that would necessarily I work. Never will. Fight. Okay, what are his moves? That is a lot of button presses for the quad grab. And that is a long... Okay. I foresee myself playing as Jackie simply because that quad gram is really long. And also he is a very slow a very slow jump. Damn it. Damn it. Okay, I think I... nope. He, uh, he missed his... ah, uh, damn it. His fatal blow, but... There we go. At the very least, so I lose my fatal blow, but at the very least I win the round by it. Just like a fraction of an inch. So what is that? It's down, back, forward, X? I think that's what it... Hmm. Ah! Oh yeah, I was gonna block, wasn't I? Okay, I blocked a hit. That didn't really help me that much because... Okay, so that was a close-range environment interaction. Finally, a grab went through. Damn it. Oh, and his fatal blow hits. I don't think it's going to kill me, though, but it's definitely going to be putting him in very good positioning. Yep. Okay, I forgot how to do the ground pound for a second there, even though I just looked at it. Yeah, I definitely foresee uh, myself playing more as, uh, as a beginner. Um, damn it. It doesn't help that you're fighting against somebody really fast. Yeah, as a beginner, I think I foresee myself using Jack, Jackie more often. Hmm. Um. Oh.
I did not know Jack, uh, Jade had that ability. I mean, they'll easily be obliterated because there are no fights against, uh, non-named characters. You'll not disturb Kronika's work. Disturb. Try ending. You're done messing with the Well of Souls. You're not as strong as you think, Jax. As I recall, Sindel made quick work of you. Let's switch to it. I'll take the lady in green. Okay, I tried to select Jackie. Clearly that did not work out. <laughs> so I'm back to uh, flailing around as uh, Jax again. Time when you knew to fight for, but between Quan Chi and Kronika, your mind ain't right. I joined Raiden against Shao Kahn. He led me to my doom. Now Raiden leads you there too. All right. Fight. At the very least, this is a good start. Um. Yeah, it's uh, it's a very it's a delayed ability. Yeah, but it definitely works in regards to. Um, never mind, that was really easy. Uh, although it helps, I think it's harder for me to fight um, Cabal because of how fast uh, Cabal moves. Like Jack Jade uh, doesn't have those teleport attacks. And... Nope. And one more. Nope. That... Nope, that, that got me. I'll still have a lot of health left, though, because I was nearly full, so this um, fatal blow isn't necessarily going to throw me off my feet, and there she goes. I'll take my chances with Rick. Yeah, you're better off. Enough dancing with the dead. Raiden said this well of souls would be underground. This way. Hmm. All right. Okay, so next time I'll try to successfully uh, select Jackie instead of, uh, Jax. You know, he does, has no, absolutely no respect for the dead. Just walks straight through that skull. And lights a cigar. This is Goro's <laughs> lair. Thankfully, mine is Goro. Shang Tsung kept me locked up here. Back at my first tournament. Never thought I'd be back. Remember where a well of Was he back for a second be? tournament? I couldn't tell you. I was pretty beat up. It's all a bit hazy. That th that all still has me wondering exactly at what point in time these characters were plucked out of, because it had to have been before they were revenants. Which was um like if Jax if it. young Jax dies by Sindel's hand during Mortal Kombat 3. Like, it would have had to be earlier than that. There's no way that thing's unguarded. Let's grab and go before whoever's on duty gets back. I never left. Noob Saiba? Oh no, you're easily defeatable shadow men. We're easy to defeat. Uh, 
But I suppose he, if he can keep making more of them. Like, is there a limit to how many shadow copies he can make of himself? Sub-Zero. Scorpion ripped out his spine, left it in a heap upstairs in Shang Tsung's old throne room. An event to the new oh. era so this is what happens to... Enough of this new era crap. I, f I feel like I forget that specific point of information. You're not rewriting history. Victors write history, and I do not know. It's like he still has a hook uh, embedded in his sh uh, shoulder. Uh, we got shrapnel blast, bionic dash. Excellent. Shrapnel blast is. Nope. I forget that uh, Noob Saibot has fantastic anti-air. Also, I don't really like uh, Jackie's jump kick. How did that miss? Hmm. You know, I might just switch back to Jax. I, I kind of like his, the, the feel of his moves more than... Damn it. More than I like Jackie's. Also, I'm, that might kill me, that might not. Yep, that did. Yeah, I think I will be switching back to... Uh, like, there's something about her. Excellent. And a throw. Like that jump kick isn't quite diagonal. It's very horizontal, which throws me off. Alright. Excellent. What else have I got? Other than just bionic dashing him to death. And yeah, her uh, uppercut is very, very short range. There we go. Who's writing history now? Come on, let's get that thing right. get out of here. That wasn't terribly painful. Although, yeah, I feel like I definitely need to. If I want to get better at this game, I will definitely need to learn more about positioning, anti-air attacks, all that. Maybe even, God willing, frame data. Is that a costume he got from, uh, Kronika? Dad? How do you get here? I'll give you one guess. Dad, your, your arms. Those look like Kronika's design. What are you doing? Giving you the life you deserve by destroying the universe, restarting it, not destroying. His teeth look very green in that light. The years I lost, the things I did. Your ma held me together, but I was never the father you needed. You're talking nonsense, man. You raised a fine daughter. She's one hell of a soldier. She shouldn't have been a soldier. I never wanted you out there taking those risks. If I hadn't fallen apart, you wouldn't have felt the need to... But is that his, uh... I do this, Dad. Please! 
but is that his job to choose that? This is seriously messed up. Hey, back here. I know I wouldn't want to fight my dad. How about we keep this between me, myself, and I? Never thought I'd stoop so low. You don't know how bad it gets. Losing your arms was just the beginning. I know you suffered. You still do. But you don't betray your unit. And you sure as hell don't betray Very much your family. so. Fight. There we go. Um, oh, I, by the way, it appears that I didn't even have to worry about choosing. Knock him off his feet. Like, that ground pound is really, really good tactically. Like, it feels like it would be a really slow move to use. Uh, but the speed of it combined with, uh, like, the fact that you can hit... Oh, nope. Now he has begun the ground pounding. Like, by the time that he gets back up onto his feet... Now you can delay your get-up, which would, um allow him to get up slower and then the ground pound wouldn't hit but there's got to be a way to make this right he's out but he'll recover how are you tripping you ditto we can't leave him let's get him and the crown out of here I never come back here. It'll be too soon. Hmm. For some reason I'm expecting one more fight. Cetrion? Surrender Kronika's crown. Does she, is she working for uh Kronika? No deal. We know you betrayed the Elder God, Cetrion. Kronika must restore the balance that Raiden destroyed. Can you not see? He is the devil in these matters. At least he's the devil we know. Can we take an Elder God? Cassie beat <laughs> shit Only because the cages are born with crazy magic powers. I've got metal arms. What else do we need? Maybe we have our own magic. Oh, uh, they also had an amulet as well. Oh, yeah, they also have the crown. Resistance only ensures your suffering. What are you doing? Stand back. We don't know what this thing will do. That crown is meant for Kronika. Your human physiology cannot control it. I just need a uh... only got to wear this thing. Yep, long yeah, there we go. Fight. Damn it. And grab. And ground pound. Nope, that was useless. And it also got me hit by a fatal blow, but that's okay. Uh, even if she wins this round, that means uh, her fatal blow will be done with for the rest of the match. And I still have my own. There we go. So she's lost her fatal blow. Oh, she's down around. Things are not looking so good for Cetrion. Uh, there we go. Okay, I can... Never mind, you're faster at that than I am. Also, how does the ground pound hit her when she's floating in the air? And there she goes. There goes, uh... Mission accomplished. Yeah, you hadn't considered that... No, oh, okay. He's able to take the crown off. I was worried for a second that, uh... 
like the crown would be stuck in its place. You were warned! Mere mortals cannot control the crown! I did not wish to harm you, but now you have forced my hand. Uh huh. You know, I thought this fight was over and everybody was gonna be okay and happy and just go back and have sandwiches somewhere. But clearly, that is not the case. Now will old Jack sacrifice himself to save his daughter? What the hell are you doing? Give me the crown, and I will spare her. Don't! Don't give it to her! Go! Her life is in your hands. I would imagine, okay, narratively, I would imagine Nobody young Jax is going to hand over the crown, um, now, so that by the time Don't we face off uh, against Kronika towards the end, she is at her most powerful. Now bring Jackie back. Although notice how uh, he throws it to old Jax and not to Dad. How could you do this to me? I'm not doing this to you, Jackie. I'm doing it for you. I love you. Kronika awaits our return. No. Although I feel that he knows he's wrong. That he did the wrong thing to make things right. In his head. This will bring us our deliverance. Thank you, both of you. I sense apprehension in Jackson. Price. Her apprehension uh, detection uh, is always on. We are unlikely allies, united for a common cause. Worry not. Liu Kang, Kitana, are the armies assembled? They're en route. Kitana and I will see that they arrive as planned. Excellent. Hmm. So many souls, so much time. I suppose it's good to know even As after you die, the time you've spent on Earth can still be to stolen from you. The report from Jacqueline Briggs. Her father's actions have compromised our situation gravely. I know. I can't. I can't. I believe, can't believe you've done this. <laughs> Even if we locate her Keith, Kronika's power now likely exceeds the might of our combined forces. Maybe we should rethink using Shinnok's amulet. We Considering it makes people evil. I've seen what you can do with it. You held off the entire Nether Realm army. You weren't even at full strength. I dare not risk the temptations of its dark power. Even now it calls to me. Despite Kronika's advantages, we must attack as soon as we know the keep's location. It's been hours since we heard from the Also, Christmas. what are we gonna do in regards to the idea that she can freeze time? Or else Or is that more of a plot device that we don't have to worry about? Scorpion. Traveling with Sub-Zero, but Sub-Zero isn't going to be doing anything, I guess. That looks really awesome. I 
physically impossible, but really awesome. Oh, never mind. Those warriors must be headed for Kronika's keep. Agreed. But why not use Karan's fleet? The bridge clearly taxes. I was power. gonna say, uh the fleet's bound to Karan. It sails only by his command. That it's still moored suggests he won't help Kronika. In which case he may help us. Okay, so the presence of Sestron here proves that this impossible bridge is still impossible even in the world of Mortal Kombat. It looks like Karan is home, perhaps hosting some unwelcome guests. Return to Earthrealm. Tell the others we found him. We'll deploy as soon as I return. Are you certain Karan will aid us? No, but he's our best chance. And we will send Sub-Zero, our greatest of messengers, to do message duty. And that is why he was written out of the plot. Although I suppose it allows uh, us to focus on Scorpion instead. Ah, it's Devora. You should have aided Kronika, Caron. Now you must suffer. I am a mortal, Devora. You cannot kill me. This one needs only render you unfit to bury Kronika's enemies. Get over here! Shinnok, now Kronika. You fight for lost causes. This one ensures the hive's survival. You will not save the Shirai Ryu. Fight. Nope, oh, that's the jumping uh, one. Um, okay, we got spear and we got heliport. Excellent. I forget that the amplified version of of that attack allows you to do more attacks rather than knocks her down. Damn it. That is very unsafe. Oh, damn, I'm now in a corner. Let's switch sides. I should use an amplified version of the, yep, yeah, of the uh, teleport. Excellent. You will not fall. Oh, young scorpion. Clan of imposters will indeed fall. I've restored the Shinai Ryu. Built a clan that's never been stronger. On a foundation of pretenders and outsiders. Kronika told me. Kronika told me about the outsiders. It was a decent movie with... Was Patrick Swayze in The Outsiders? I honestly don't remember. Also, that would be really cool if you can actually do that in the game. There is no Shirai Ryu. Our clan's massacre extinguished them. Kronika will revive the true Shirai Ryu in the new era. Do not trust Kronika. She uses your anger to enslave you, as Quan Chi did both of us. I let go my rage, and it's safe. Ah, so we're so this is definitely post murder. Yeah, this is definitely post murder of Sub Zero Scorpion, who took revenge on 
uh, Sub Zero for his uh, for the death of his clan, despite the fact that Sub Zero didn't actually kill them. Ah, he's using my own moves against me. There we go. <laughs> ah, damn it. Oh my, we, we both are missing attacks left and right. I'm lucky he wasn't able to capitalize on that poor hit. And I also forget that you could use that teleport move in the air, which is also very useful. Truly drives you. It's not Shirai Ryu pride. It's your wife and child. That kind of sorta rhymes. Harumi and Satoshi were stolen from me. Murdered. Seeing them again is all that matters. We share this pain. I fought through hell to end it. But Kronika's new era is not the remedy. She would resurrect Shinnok, the same devil who brought death to our family and clan. He cannot be allowed to return. When I revived the Shirai Ryu, I vowed our clan would ensure Earthrealm's protection. Help me keep that promise. Oh? Nope, that's just... That's just Devora again. Okay, things don't look quite so good for older Scorpion. Poison. Chronica knew your past sins would distract you. Now this one ends your misery. Oh. Okay. Raiden is at the Fire Gardens. Enlist Karan's aid. Bring Raiden's army to the keep. You must. You have my word. Huh. I was not expecting old uh, Scorpion to die and just get replaced by his younger... Version. The new shrine are you are worthy. It's heart, not blood, that makes them warriors. Huh. Also, it's, it seems like we're skipping over that uh, conversation that Scorpion has with uh, Charon in order to advance the plot. Your Shaolin masters, they're ready. They will fight until the last man. That is likely what it will take. There will not be a fight if Karon does not help us. Is there any word from Grandmaster Hasashi? No. If we do not hear soon, I will return to the Nether Realm. Wrong Scorpion. This cannot be good. Get Raiden. Fire gardens. They built. Are they going to have an accidental fight because they're not willing to talk to each other? Why are you here, Scorpion? Where is Grandmaster Hasashi? He is dead. And now you have come to finish us. I understand your mistrust, but I am here to assist you. I find that impossible oh. to believe. Fight. Nope. Nope, that's a jumping belt. Excellent. Although he's got a lot of good uh, long-range attacks as well, so...
Does a throw, even when it's blocked, uh, cause some damage? Alright, that was pretty easy. Okay, he was- he did a lot of good blocks there. And one of those. And there we go. Yeah, that is an excellent way to really throw your opponent off. And I wonder if the two swipes he does when you do an amplified version of the uh, the teleport, uh, whether that does two different levels of uh, attack. Who sent you here, Scorpion? My future self is dead. I am here at his behest. Grandmaster Hasashi sent you. I honor his dying wish. Karan will ferry your armies to the Isle of Kronika. We must leave at once. Do you have proof of Karan's offer? Only my word. Your word is worthless. At the tournament, I trusted you to spare Bihar. Oh my gosh. Me. Am I going to have to fight everybody? I seek redemption. Lie, Scorpion. You are a slave, and Kronika is your master. I feel like these are like the... Fight. Uh, in Mortal Kombat 9, like a lot of those... A lot of the fights in the beginning kind of felt like filler. Uh, and th these two fights especially feel like filler fights. Like, not quite as meaningful because it's just basically like... Hmm, a lot of things to just jump off of. There we go. Like, uh, they're basically allies who are having a disagreement. There we go. Aha! And one more. All right. First, listen to my fists. Then, listen to my words. It is no trap. Karan awaits you in the nether realm. Thank you for watching. Questions, comments, recommendations for something to play next? Comment down below or send it on over to it sounded good on paper at gmail.com. That's it sounded good on paper at gmail.com. So long for now.